guys, so we're gonna do something a little different for you today. We're going to open up a coconut and a pineapple. First, the coconut. You need to find out the face of the coconut. This has already been husked. It used to be yellow or green on the outer husk. When it's green or yellow, it's called a new. And what that means is that the, the nut inside, the meat inside is still forming, but there's a lot of coconut water in there. And that's what we're after today. And then the meat is secondary and it's also really yummy and delicious. As it gets more and more mature and the outer husk starts to turn brown, there's gonna be more and more meat as the coconut water becomes meat. So right now we're just gonna get the coconut water out and then there should be a little bit of young meat in there and that's delicious to eat as well. Usually when you buy a new, this is how it comes and it comes with this little like cap on top and the reason why they leave it on there is because it's so young that sometimes it'll just open up. Oi. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna slice this off a little bit. And when you slice it off, now you can see that there's a little bit of a face. You got two eyes here and you got the mouth. So even on a much more mature coconut or popo, you have two eyes and a mouth. And the way you can tell the difference is that the two eyes are kind of slanted on the, on the upper slant of the coconut, whereas the mouth is always gonna be, it's kind of flat. Even when you shave this off, it's gonna be flat. <clears throat> now I don't wanna shave it off too deep or else it's just gonna pop up and all the coconut water will come out this way. So right now, if you just wanna drink the coconut water, you just pop this open like this. You just cut open the mouth and then you stick a straw in there and then you can drink it, tasty treat. But what we wanna do is we wanna crack the coconut. So the way you crack the coconut is you find the two eyes. So here are the two eyes here. And then you see the line that goes right in between the two eyes. And you take something hard, either a rock or a cleaver like we have, and you crack it right over this. And then it, it should split into two halves. See now there's another, there's another line here that goes kind of between the eye and the mouth, goes here. And then there's another line here that goes between this, the right left eye and the mouth goes right here. So from the back, it's a little bit easier to tell. Here's the line between the eyes, and here's the two other lines. There's not a fourth line here, just in, in kind of thirds. So here's the line between the eyes, and you just gotta hit it across that line between the eyes. So if you hit it right, you should be able to come up with two equal halves. And there's all the coconut water with some young meat inside. So the coconut water is super delicious. On these news, the coconut water is super, super sweet. And delicious to the taste. What's also kind of cool is the meat is super, super soft. So soft that sometimes you can even push it out with your thumb. Look at how soft that meat is. Coconut meat. Delicious. I'll try it. With my bare hands. Anuya. <laughs> is it good? Mm -hmm. It's delicious, isn't it's it? It's really sweet and um if if you get the new part first, well this tastes like um some new, but it also tastes like like not regular meat, but like um Island meat, so it's really good. <laughs> Island meat? Island meat. Okay, let's do the pineapple. So in Samoa, and this is called Fala, it's pineapple, it's a local pineapple. There's a little bit of difference to this pineapple as compared to the pineapples that we have in the States. These have the pokey edges here, and they, um, they're a little bit smaller, but they're so juicy. And the core on the pineapple on the Samoan Fala is actually edible. It's not like the cores that we get in the United States where you, you really have to cut around the core. Here you slice it up and you just eat straight through the core. All you do with the pineapple, just like you would in the States, you cut the top off. Make sure you got a real nice sharp knife. Now look at this core. The core is just, it's just, it's a smaller core, but it's golden all the way through. But you still have these, um, I don't even know what these things are called. If you know what these things are called, please comment below what they're called. Uh, anyway, you have these little blemishes on the, on the, 
outer ring that you got to get rid of. So you cut the top off, you cut the top off, you cut the bottom off, and you're left with this chunk here. What we usually do, or what I had always done in the States, was I would chop off this, right? Well, when you do that, you're losing a lot of meat, and then you still have a lot of these whatever you tell me these things are called you still have a lot of these things stuck inside one of my aunties came over and she told me this is how you cut a fala so she just sticks the knife in here and kind of follows it through and then she just cuts the skin off basically she like fillets the skin off then you're left with just the pineapple from here slice it up And you have a super refreshing treat straight for the babies. Noli, is it yummy? Did daddy do a good job? Yeah? Really fresh island treat just from our house to yours. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you've learned something new because I definitely did. I had no idea you could do the follow like this and it's amazing. It saves you a lot of meat and a lot of cleanup because you just have three pieces of cleanup. The top, the middle, and the bottom and you're you're good to go. Nolly, Nolly you want some more? Pinko. There's a road that leads to pain If we go down it there's a chance we won't make it back We better move to the positive Say bye 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 we could stay awake all night and have dinner in bed Slowly watch as the sun rises, I'll fall asleep instead The coconut we're gonna do first and um... Mom! <laughs> okay, so put do her down that. for now please uh, she, she, come. You farting. <laughs> Dad.